and things back to you. Hey, Lee, come on over because we got something that just smells delicious over here. Now on <laughs> Bounce, we got pizza. You want to introduce these? Yeah, gentlemen? we have Stevie D and Jimmy D. Steve and Jim DiPolito from Basante Pizza Company. Thank you so much for being here. This already looks amazing. <laughs> Thanks so much you for having us. haven't even started yet. But tell us what you're going to make here today. Well, what we're going to do, we're going to make uh, two pizza shells. Um, mm -hmm. Right now, Jim's doing a, a New York style. He's stretching it out. Uh, now he's pressing out the air bubbles and he's, he's building the crust. So now he's slapping out the dough. He's mm -hmm. going to stretch it to size. <laughs> and in a minute here, Sarah, we're going to be working with some red sauce, and it should be real good with your that white dress. That is nice. That's sweet, yes. It's not good with my dog on blue suit, yeah. though. It'll hide the work on with black. That's impressive. How long do you have to take you to learn that? Because a lot of people uh, say that, and uh, that's well, cool, but how long mm -hmm. does it take you to learn how to do that? The, the interesting part, Jim's been doing it for about 35 years. Mm -hmm. I've been doing it for about 15. Jim's worked for some of the major um, pizzerias in western New York. That's where we're originally from, yeah. Buffalo, New York. Okay. So it's in your genes. It's in our genes. Yeah. Yeah. You know, when I was 13 years old, I, I started making pizza, and I said, you know, I'm going to do this the rest of my life. Yeah. And I have. Okay. And I really have. And, I, you know, I always wanted to, and it was something that, that stuck with me. Now, you guys are from Buffalo. I just asked Lee and Sarah what it felt like, the humidity and heat. What do you guys think about the humidity and the heat here? You know, we love it because in Buffalo we get minus 30 degree uh -huh. wind chill factors, so uh, the heat's no problem for us. We actually played golf this morning, Steve and I, so okay. we enjoyed the weather very good. much. Mm -hmm. All right, good yes. deal. Now, how long have you guys been around for? Did you, uh, you, it's, I see number one pizzeria, uh, and, and you've been winning honors and awards for a long time, right? We, we did. We won uh, Come on best. Square up to the camera. Let see that. We won the uh, best pizza in Charlotte uh, two years ago, pizza contest, mm -hmm. pizza wars, and uh, we've been at the rest of this restaurant for three years now, so. Uh, uh, things are going really, really well. Um, you can see over on the table there we do great chicken wings and pastas and other things as well as the pizza. Okay. In fact, next week is our third year anniversary where we're doing a big special. Any large pizza we're doing for half price. That includes special teas, and that's for three days in a row, 27th, 28th, and 29th. Three days, three years, half wow. price. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Any pizza at all. What's your most popular seller, if you would? I think um, a lot of people are real traditional, cheese pepperoni. Yeah. That's that's very that's popular. Neat. And on the specialty pizzas, we're going to be building a, a ch buffalo chicken finger pizza, and uh, that's that's our best specialty. Okay, so we got the pepperoni. And there, so once right? we do that, yep, uh, what goes kind into of the cheese oven. Is, that? is there more than one type of cheese on that? Uh, on this particular pizza, it's just mozzarella. Mm -hmm. um, on the buffalo chicken finger pizza, we're going to have some fontanella cheese on it as well as the mozzarella. Mm -hmm. Now, you notice there's two different ways we do this. This is the New York style, and it's hand tossed, and it gets a little bit thinner. Uh -huh. And then what this one is, it's called the buffalo style. So like a medium thickness. Okay. So you notice I don't throw it. It doesn't get floured. We actually press this one out on a pan, okay. and then we also form the crust real nice. Um, so it's a little bit different, a little thicker. It holds the toppings on a little bit better. Mm -hmm. um, I tend to like this one a little bit better than the other one, personally. Okay. What cheese put on there? Now, What's right there? here, I'm doing is our homemade signature blue cheese. Mm. Um, we make this from scratch, too. We don't buy blue cheese and add milk like some right. places. Yeah. Yeah. We make it right ain't, ain't nobody, from... Ain't nobody got time for that. that was gonna be real deal. My we next make this question. right yeah. from scratch. Yeah. You make your tomato sauce, too. We make our tomato sauce. Our meatballs are mm -hmm. all homemade. Uh, my dad's, you know, recipe from uh, from Italy. And, uh, you know, the, I mean, the meatball sub is just I know, one of my I, best sellers. Yes, yes. We, can't, uh, we can't keep those in the house. <laughs> and then what we do, we put do the homemade blue cheese, a little bit of seasonings on here. And then we also do a little bit of Romano cheese. Mm -hmm. So this one's actually going to have three kinds of cheese. This cheese here that I'm using is a uh, Italian imported cheese. Okay. It's called Fontanella. Not a lot of places carry that mm -hmm. Fontanella cheese. One mm -hmm. other thing we do is we use Frank's hot sauce. We're from Buffalo. Frank's, Frank's hot, hot sauce. Go ahead and bring up the full screen particular. so everybody can see where, they, where they're located. Go ahead. That's the we got about original. 20 seconds. That's the Come original on in, guys. right there. Then we do the chicken fingers on this guy right here. Mm-hmm. And, bro, bro, the too. and then you know, and then once our chicken fingers are all spread out, we go right back with the mozzarella. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell you, this signature pizza here, this specialty, is probably our best seller. Wow, look oh. at this oh. finished product. Pizza. Look at the that thing day. right there. Ooh. That's what it looks that like. That is a thing of beauty. <laughs> Guys, yeah. congratulations to you on a great success. Thank you, Thank so, you much. so much. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching really WBTV News on Bounce. We'll be back with more news at 11 over on WBTV. Great job, guys. We're going to eat. <laughs>